Yeah, I'm sure a huge round belly is a massive turn on. Um, can we talk about something else? Sure. Sorry, I didn't mean to make you feel uncomfortable. No, it's just everyone at uni is always talking and thinking about sex. Oh, exactly. So imagine how I feel. You know, at least you have a boyfriend. Mm-hmm. Who you never see. Sorry, is that why you're getting so weird about it? I'm not being weird. It's just... Even if I did see him, we haven't exactly gone there yet. So you're just as frustrated as me. That's not funny. <laughs> it's a little bit funny. Oh, stop it. It it's is. Funny. It's a bit, I'm sorry, but it's just... It's, um, it's not funny. Now, do you promise not to be judgmental, um, overreact or freak out? Well, how can I promise when I have no idea what you're about to tell me? Well, you know, it's just a very sensitive issue when young people are confused. Well, I'm confused, so if you don't tell me what's going on... OK, you know how sometimes when people of one sex want to change to be the other? Mm, uh, gender dysphoria. When someone's born male, it feels female, or, or vice versa, of course. That's it. Yeah, and some feel it necessary to have a sex change as a result. Oh. But that doesn't necessarily mean that they really want to have a sex change. I mean, um, some men might just like the feeling of dressing up in women's clothes. I mean, they're so flowy and free and... Are we talking about someone that we both know? I've always found that wearing trousers can be a little bit constrictive, don't you think, Harine? Uh, love, I'm probably not the right person to be asking. I'm perfectly comfortable in them. Mm. Well, then there's skirts. I mean, skirts are lovely. The feeling on, on bare legs and... Marilyn. Um, it sticks. I caught him cross-dressing. What? Now, I don't think that definitely means he's going to have a sex change. No, I, I, I think you're mistaken. <laughs> There's no mistake. Uh, I saw him wearing my clothes, made up as a woman. Come in. I got your text. Look, it's better be good. I had to sit next to a total freak on the bus ride over here. So, what's the big surprise? Well, I've been... Well, apart from the fact you're wearing makeup. <laughs> Look, I've been working on this blog entry and it's kind of only half finished, so I need a second opinion, OK? Be honest. Honestly, I don't think blue is your colour. Maybe you should, you should try green. Are you going to explain the makeup? Yes, it's all going to be explained right now. So what do girls want in a guy anyways? <laughs> Oh, you make a cute chick. Thanks. A nice smile. It's good waves. You should get out there. Yeah, I can now that I finished my shift. Hey, Casey. Yep. About the assignment. Look, forget it, OK? I'm not going to need your help again. Miles knows I talked you through it. So what? Well, so I told him the work was yours, but I'm not sure he believed me. Yeah, that'd be right. Can you blame him? You haven't handed anything in yet. So the one time I make an effort, I get hassled about it. Is that it? Look, no matter what I do here, mate, people are down on me. Miles is just trying to help. He's not the enemy. <laughs> Who is? Well, if anyone, I have to say you. When things get difficult, you just flip out like yesterday. Look, forget yesterday. Casey, you totally lost yeah. it. And I can see things Look, aren't great at It's none of your business, OK? You can't just lash out Look, at get people. off my case. All right, seriously. Foosball and surf. Okay. Like that? No, you have to tighten that cut there. You kind of pussy. Oh, well, someone's got a rain. Hello. Hey, Marilyn. Hey. Hey, Dad. Hi. Play foosball. Surf. Surf. The ability to play the guitar. Play foosball. Surf. Do you want something? Uh, can we have a word in private, please? Sorry, my problem. All right, that's okay. I should get home anyway. See you, thanks. Thanks. I'll walk you to the door. What's going on? I noticed you're wearing makeup. Yeah, it's Marilyn's. So I hope she doesn't mind. I, I put it all back where I found it. Okay. But the thing is, um, why do you feel the need to wear Marilyn's makeup in the first place? Well, Andy's was the wrong skin tone. Is this something you do often? No. 
No. Today was just a special occasion. How so? Well, Sheila wanted to come out and talk. Who's Sheila? The teenage girl inside all of us. Would you like to meet her? Uh, no. Might be necessary. Dex, are you comfortable in your own body? Because if you're confused about your sexuality or, or gender... Dad, Dad, you should see your face right now. You're so serious. Well, this is serious. And I want you to know that if you need to talk to me, I will listen. I won't judge. Dad, she was just a character in my blog. A blog? Well, I might give up and go home. It doesn't look like Romeo's going to turn up. Well, have you tried calling him? I saw him at work today. Yeah, he finished an hour ago, though. I messaged him, but there was no reply. Yeah? I guess I've been stood up. Oh, no, he wouldn't do that. Well, then he's forgotten, which isn't much better. So much for making an effort. Oh, we can't say that he hasn't made an effort lately. Can't I? Well, yeah, I mean, like, cooking you dinner and he went all the way to the farm to surprise you. Oh, so it's my fault that he's forgotten me, then? No, I'm... I'm not saying that, I'm just saying that maybe you shouldn't be so angry with him. W wouldn't you be? Yeah, but I'd also be upset and disappointed. I am those things! Okay, it's just that you sound a little bit more annoyed than anything else. Well, I guess it's just... It's like you said, I'm, I'm frustrated, but not just physically. I shouldn't be this hard to see my boyfriend, and to be honest, when we do see each other, it's not the same as it used to be. Yeah, but not all couples go through rough patches. It's, it's normal. What am I supposed to do? I don't, I don't want to keep going like this. Well, you, well, you can't work it out. I've tried. We've, we've both tried. Well, you know, maybe it's time that you let him go. Girls wanting a guy anyways. A hot body. A nice smile. Lots of cash. Quick wheels. The ability to play the guitar, play foosball and surf. Did I mention a hot body? Yeah, mm -hmm. that's who. Girls also want someone who can make them laugh. <laughs> oh, and the guy has to be hot. Did I say that already? Oh. Hot, huh? Yeah, you like this. Oh. <laughs> Yay! That's very clever, Dex. You look great in my top. Thanks. I hope you don't mind me borrowing it. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. You know, I'm really glad that you wore it in the name of art. You did have me a bit right there. <laughs> art? So you really liked it? <laughs> we loved it. Didn't we, Sid? Yes, it was, um, well made. But are you sure you want to post that online? <laughs> My fans are waiting for a follow-up piece, Dad. Follow-up to what? Not the thing you did about bullying. You said that was a video diary. Hmm. An online video diary. You're kidding me. People relate to my work, Dad. Well, how many have seen it? A few. Well, you've got to take it down before this gets out of hand. No, I don't want to. Oh, see, it is just a joke. <laughs> yeah, at his own expense. I mean, is it so hard for you to fit in, Dexter? That's why I made it, Dad, to show how hard it is. I mean, guys are expected to be so many different things you, at once. Do you know what I see? I just see a kid determined to be weird who's going to get picked on and left out. Sid! What, would you rather I say nothing? What, would you rather I let him post this online? Hmm? If anyone at school sees this... I'm posting it on the web, Dad. OK. Well, I guess you're old enough to make your own mistakes. to be late, don't you? Yeah, which is exactly why I'm going to get going. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, Sid. Come on, keep me company. That's better. Okay. So do you want to, like, go get a coffee or something? Um, look, I'd love to. I'd better make tracks, though. Okay. You just... Yeah, another time. Yeah.
so much for thinking he's a sexist pig. One minute you're annoyed at him, the next you're snuggling up to him on the beach. Well, I don't really see a reason why I shouldn't, do you? Casey's got issues. You don't want to get sucked into that, you'll just get burned. Jeez, I thought you guys were friends. Well, we are. Sort of. Well, if he's good enough for you to hang out with, then he's good enough for me too. Just be careful, all right? I mean, if you're seriously considering hooking up with him. I already have. <laughs> well, I'm not dating anyone right now. So unless you have anything else to say. It's your call. If you want to see Casey, go for it. Next time on Home and Away. What do you say? He just said to stay away from you. Apparently you're trouble. Where do you get off saying it? Back off! Oh my gosh, guys! Oh, no. I feel like maybe we're drifting apart. So what do you want to do? I think we need to talk. Indy's kind of planned a special night for the two of them. How special? Blank from you's first night special. Maybe we could hang out a bit more. Go out on a date or something. If you want to be with Casey, if that's what you want, you should go for it. I don't want to be with Casey, you idiot. I can't be with the person that I want to be with. Why not? Because he's you. Catch up on what's happening on Home and Away online at Yahoo 7 TV.